Hey class, and welcome to the sorting polygons tutorial. Well, why do we need to know this? Being able to sort polygons helps you to understand what makes one polygon similar or different to another. So for example, if I was to ask Brendan, Brendan, what's the difference between a square and a rectangle? Well, if you know how to sort polygons, you'll be able to explain that properly. So here's five criteria or questions that I use. So sides, the amount of sides. So how many sides are there? Lengths, the sides. Um, are there equal length sides? And if so, how many? Uh, whether or not the sides are parallel. Are there any parallel sides? They might be in pairs. Parallel means that two sides, two lines, never cross. If they extend forever, they still won't cross. They run side by side straight. Angles. What types of angles are inside of the polygon? So inside of the polygon, there might be acute angles or obtuse angles or right angles or maybe a combination. Symmetry. How many lines of symmetry are there? Symmetry just means that if you put a line through a shape, if you fold it over, it will fold over perfectly so that it divides the shape in half perfectly. So I'm going to throw in one right away and get started. So here's an isosceles triangle and I'll use those five criteria and questions to uh, sort it. So looking at this triangle, I'll answer the first question. So how many sides are there? There are three sides, right? One, two, three. Are there equal length sides? And if so, how many? Yep. Uh, two sides are equal and one is different, it's shorter. Uh, are there any parallel sides? No, there's not. These two actually meet here and this one doesn't have a straight line going across from it. Are there, what kinds of angles are inside of it? Well, there's an angle here and it's acute and acute and acute, so there's three acute angles. And is there a line of symmetry? I'll do it in blue so you can see it. Uh, yes, there is, there's one. If I put a line through it and I fold it over in half, it will actually fold over perfectly. So it divides it in half, so there's one line of symmetry. Here's another one. I'll put a rectangle inside of it and I'm gonna let you try it. So um, go ahead, I want you to press pause and try to answer those five questions check it out yourself and try it and uh, after you're done press play again and we'll see if your answers match my answers so go ahead and press pause so hopefully yours answers answer looks like mine so asking myself how many sides are there there are four sides and are there equal length sides yeah there are two pairs one pair is here these two sides are equal and another pair is here these two sides are equal are there any parallel sides? Well, yeah, there's two pairs again. This pair will never cross. See, they'll go straight forever. And these two sides will never cross. So there's another pair. So there's two pairs. One, two. What kinds of angles? What types of angles? Well, they're all right angles. One, two, three, four. Four right angles. And are there lines of symmetry? Yep, but there are two lines of symmetry. I'll try to draw a straight line through. Uh, if I fold it here across, it folds in half perfectly. And if I go this way, sorry, my line's not the straightest right now. If I fold it up across that way, it folds it in half. One common mistake is that people think that there's one across there, but that's not actually uh, a line of symmetry because it actually won't fold over perfectly. So don't, sh don't include that one. So two lines of symmetry. I'll put another one in here. Here's a rhombus. Again, give it a shot. Try to answer those five questions and we'll see if your answers match mine. So go ahead and press pause. So hopefully uh, your answers will match mine again. I'm gonna answer those five criteria questions. Sides, so how many sides are there? Well, there are four sides. And are there any equal sides? Yeah, there's actually four equal sides. This is equal to that, which is equal to that, which is equal to that. Are there any parallel sides? Yep, there's two pairs again. Uh, one here. These two will never cross. And another pair. These two will never cross. So two pairs. What kinds of angles are inside of it? Well, there's a pair of acute angles. Acute, less than 90, less than 90. A pair of obtuse, greater than 90, greater than 90. And are there lines of symmetry? Yep, there are two lines again. One through the middle this way. I'll try to draw it across. So that divides it in half perfectly. And one actually going through this way, splitting this in half perfectly. So they'll fold over perfectly. And there you go, sorting polygons, five minutes.